Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked it. Yo, if I'm being real, so it's the first day of class. It is 7 freaking 40 and I have to be there. Well, like our thing starts at 8 30. It takes me 30 minutes to get there. Not to mention, like, I have to find parking. Like, I'm so frustrated. Like, I'm not letting my running behind get the best of me or anything. But, like, the crazy thing is I woke up one time. Like, I woke up at, like, 3-something because I couldn't sleep. And then it was, like, honestly, I'm a, okay, I'm the type of person I don't really like sleep from like nerves or anything. I'm not even nervous about today. So what ended up happening was last night the guy I've been seeing, like we were gonna hang out and um just for a little bit before I had to go to bed because I was like, you know, I'm not trying to stay up all night. Y'all then okay, let's side note. So y'all see I have my freaking hair in a freaking claw clip back here because I may end up taking it out. It doesn't look bad actually, but like the curls have followed, which I expected it of course, cause I wasn't finna pin curl it. Um, but whatever. So I had to hit my leave out this morning. No big deal. Um, like honestly, last night I should have went and got. <sighs> I've been on break since like 11 20 something and i don't have to be back up at my next thing until 1 30 um but i'm right outside the building i'm in the parking lot i'm just you know chilling regrouping there was literally nothing to film we were literally sitting in an auditorium waiting for everyone to do a drug test um they didn't talk to us i mean of course they talked to us but 
like there was no like real information other than like a five minute lecture on how to navigate canvas which is like blackboard or you know like little school um app or whatever um but yeah so i'm just hanging out waiting for my sister to call me back um just you know enjoying some peace and quiet um i do have some a couple of chapters to read tonight so um yeah we're gonna go ahead and hit it hard i'm gonna go ahead and do it as soon as i get home and then uh study a little bit go over a few like study my flashcards a little bit and then hopefully i will um if i don't do it right when i get home i might take a little break couple hour break and then start around maybe like six um and just kind of like hang out with my my friend so for a little bit just to regroup um after i get out of this next class so yeah that's it y'all okay y'all so i just left from getting my id made so i have been taking classes at this school i guess technically for like since june and i never got an id made because i didn't feel the need to because i was online always so now i'm having to get an id made because i need one now and now like one day i need to come up here and walk around this campus to familiarize myself with these buildings because i'm over here now having to ride through campus so slow I still got an hour though before I have to be back at class, so I'm good, but um I just have to freaking creep through campus because I'm looking for the cafeteria because I need to go to the bookstore. Yeah. So
I fell asleep sleep when I worked for the first time. I didn't get a good until my alarm went off, but. <sighs> I mean, you know how when an alarm wakes you up, it's like jarring. finished adding the rest of like all of my assignments lectures labs all of that to my calendar um my calendar looks so full y'all now i'm not gonna lie then i added like my work shifts for next week um because we get our work shifts a week at a time so i went and did that and then i took a nap right at four and i woke up at like 5 15 then i had to like return some phone calls people love to call me when i'm asleep child but so I was like, okay, let me go ahead and buckle down. Cause when I go to sleep in the middle of the day, I can't sleep through the night. So I was like, well, I'll just stay up a little late. Tomorrow's Friday anyway. So I was like, I'll stay up a little late and just, you know, do my reading. My reading, I don't actually have that much to read. Um, but it'll still take me a couple of hours because I'm gonna take some notes because we um went over just basically how to really break down these objectives and note take before class so hopefully it'll go faster than what it did when i tried to read tuesday night because that was not working um so and then i had some stuff to print out and upload before tomorrow y'all of course in the middle of printing my little uh printer starts like making this little doorbell sound and was just me it was out of freaking paper so I had to go to Walmart and get some paper. Well, excuse me, I tried to go to Walmart and get some paper. Walmart was out of paper. So I had to drive to Target, which is on the opposite side of town. Like, And then I had to go the long way because there was a wreck if I took the shortcut, which goes back by my house. There was a freaking wreck. And I'm just like, oh my God, what, could, what else could go wrong? So now it's seven o'clock. So I'll probably, I kid you not, I probably will be up to about two. Um, I may be able to get it done before like midnight if I really, really buckle down. Um, Cause I really don't have that much to do if I'm being for real, um, but still. Okay, y'all, so it is Saturday. I did not even get a lot of rest. It is 10 o'clock in the morning. I have work at 11. 
but I have to go to the uniform store to get some scrub pants. So I'm gonna do that before work because it's literally right next door to my job. So that's a plus because they'll be closed by the time I get off and I have lab on Monday. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna go to work, of course. And then I'm gonna come home and just chill. Last night, um, I had my friend over. He came at like midnight because I didn't get off till like 11. Um, and I took a shower and stuff like that. And I just wanted to see him because I don't really, well, I'm not really seeing him during the week right now um, just because of school. Um, but like y'all, it was so much fun. Um, my bad, it was so much fun last night. Like I really needed that like de-stressing the time because I left school, I took a nap. And then when I got to work, I was stressed at work. Like it was so much going on. It was a lot of commotion. And for a Friday night, I really did not make that much money. I made a good bit of money, I guess, just like overall. But for a Friday night, I didn't make that much. And yeah, but um, it was still pretty chill. But so I'm going in today, gotta work tomorrow. Run a few errands this week. And then tomorrow I'm just gonna like review what we did last week and look over some things this week like when I get off today I'm actually going to deep clean well not really deep clean but just straighten my apartment up a little bit so that tomorrow when I get off work I can actually focus on studying because I can like study and clutter but anyways guys I will talk to you guys later I might check in at the uniform so I don't know but regardless I gotta start driving y'all y'all Y'all, 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 y'all. Uh. Okay, I don't know if I told y'all. I don't know if I told y'all, but so we took our first quiz, just a little safety quiz on Friday. It was just like on like safety policies um, and like procedures, really. I made a 96. Um, but now we have like our first quiz on like actual information, you know what I mean? Like stuff that we've been taught and like we're supposed to be reading and stuff like that. Oh my God. So we have that today. I actually feel, I don't want to say I feel like super prepared, but I feel good about it. I'm not going to lie, but we're going to see. Oh, hold on y'all. So I had to get my privacy screen. I forgot it. Can't be getting the elf over something like that. So yeah, I gotta get on the roll because I gotta give me something to eat. Um, but y'all, yesterday was our first lab. It was just like bed making. Um, and like bathing and stuff like that and my my uh clinical instructor y'all she is so sweet i'm so glad i got her um but she came up to me she was like inspecting my bed she was like how did you get your stuff so straight because like it's hard to me it is kind of difficult well i'm sure to everybody it's obviously more difficult to make an occupied bed than an unoccupied bed but a lot of people don't know i used to work in a hospital so yeah i had like and i worked there for like over a year so and it was recent it was like what last year so it was pretty like fresh on my mind you know um what was she wrong with it but so anyway yes oh my god his his tire fled show y'all what I do and it has been helping me so much 
um because it's a way that like well, you know when you take notes when you read it you kind of really bar barely paying attention to what you're reading um so you kind of have to go back and reread your notes to even know kind of what you wrote um but the way that like one of our instructors uh showed me how to do it i'm not gonna lie like it's actually working like it is a time consuming process but i can still get it done like it's doable i'm not gonna lie um but yeah so i'm gonna update y'all when i get out of class um i don't have class tomorrow i'm still gonna do a little work tonight like i'm gonna finish some notes that i was taking this morning oh please move um I'm gonna finish the notes that I was taking this morning, this afternoon. If I come home and take my daily afternoon nap. Um, and then I'm probably gonna study like tonight because I do have a test on Friday as well. So, y'all, uh, it's, it's revving up, you know. But anyway, I don't know why I'm in such a good mood because I don't know. Whatever. We'll see if I'm still in a good mood around two o'clock. But yeah. Um, I'm about to hit the interstate so y'all know. I'm about to put on my music. I'll see y'all later. of hours and then i'm gonna go do some laundry and um go to work i know one thing and that is it is cold okay it's freezing freaking cold my hands almost fell off when i was with my gas but y'all i've been up since two this morning i went to bed like i studied y'all know it's friday i got tested today so i studied from like seven until like 10 um, and I felt pretty confident, but I wanted to save like a fresh mind for this, uh, for the chapter on infection control. Um, so this morning I woke up at two o'clock and I didn't start really studying until about three and I studied from like three to seven and I'm feeling actually really good. Um, I don't want to make this a habit, but I, like I said, I really wanted to make sure that I say like a rich mind to look over that chapter instead of like studying really really late like starting because you know I finished what was it vital signs and pain around 10 30 I wasn't gonna start a fresh a new chapter especially one that I really need to focus on that late but 
work really but instead of doing like an outro like I normally do I'm gonna just talk to y'all real quick baby <laughs> who said I was gonna go to nursing school and make our A's <laughs> y'all I had a breakdown Friday and I couldn't bring myself to record it because I just can't go out like that but I'm telling y'all I was crying like all day like after my um after my exam we we get our grade back immediately but then they go in and like basically regrade it you know um so um and then they you know give you a final grade so i get my grade back and it's a 79.5 i'm disappointed um but i'm like okay when, when they regrade it like more than likely it'll go up y'all didn't take them long get another like 30 minutes into our lecture we get a you know email that our tests have been regraded and my score is still a 79.5 and from that point forward i didn't hear nothing else in class because i'm thinking i ain't no way i just made 79.5 like i barely passed this test and i'm like getting frustrated because i'm like i know i knew this material you know what i'm saying like i practice our online like um questions i practice the questions in the back of the chapters like when I would go over my objectives, I could actually like without looking at my notes, I could like go through in detail and like answer the objectives. So I'm like, what did I do? You know what I'm saying? Like, what is going on? So my clinical instructor comes back this week. So I'm gonna meet with her and um, just sit down and go over my test because yeah. Now I will say before we test it, um, one of our instructors was just like do not change y'all's answers don't change them so i said okay but i went back i ain't gonna lie i went back and changed about four or five answers so i am interested to see which ones i got wrong because if it's the ones i changed i promise i'll never change another answer but um if it's not then i just don't know what i thought i knew or whatever so yeah but other than that today i just went grocery shopping y'all ain't no way i went to sam's and spent 130 dollars and only got 22 items like but i got all produce so um because i am going back vegan y'all i have been saying i'm going back vegan for i don't know how long and i finally decided to do it like i talked to my friend today and he was just like yeah he was like, i'll do what you like so I was like, I don't, I'm not gonna depend on him because I feel like he gonna be cheating if he really do it with me, but whatever. It's for myself anyway, but I'm bad, y'all. But, um, so today, I'm gonna ball out real quick. I'm so hungry. It's four o'clock and I haven't eaten. I didn't have a sip of water today because I've been cleaning all day after this dog. So, I'm trying this look. This is not vegan. I'm starting tomorrow, y'all. But it smells good. This is this Mediterranean salad that I got from Sam's, y'all. This big salad, it's a Mediterranean pasta salad. This salad was $5.78. Looks pretty good. But I like little stuff like that. It's like kale, sun dried tomatoes, pasta, Parmesan cheese, like a vinaigrette. Gotta see what else is really in there. Crumble feta here. Let's see. Get a lot of stuff on my fork. Yeah, I love me a good salad. It's definitely got some basil in here. Personally, I hate basil because it's so strong. And a little bit goes a very long way. But it's actually not bad. Like, it's actually good. Mmm. Anyways, y'all. I'm gonna put my groceries up do my laundry and finish cleaning because my baby finna come see me so 
someone spent a little bit of time with him. Now I gotta get back to the books. And I gotta practice. Well, I'm gonna take his vital signs. That's what I'm gonna do. I wanted to take him last night, but he was acting crazy. So I ended up just taking like his sisters and stuff. So yeah. Whatever. But y'all, I don't have too much sales to say. This week, hopefully I do because I'm starting to get into a routine of how I'm studying. So this week I'm gonna try to do a little bit more content on like what I do outside of class, how I'm studying. So not only can you guys like, I guess, pull some things that I'm doing, but also tell me what's working for y'all and say like, hey, maybe this isn't working as effectively as you think. You know, stuff like that. Cause y'all, I need the help. Cause I am not gonna get another 79 point nothing. I had my skills check off Wednesday. I'm, nervous and excited at the same time and we go to one of our facilities on Thursday but just for like orientation so I may take y'all in there if I can but other than that y'all that's all not really even gonna get into the whole freaking outro you all know I really appreciate I appreciate y'all spending time with me so thank you so so much don't forget to like comment share and subscribe if you enjoy sticking around and hanging out with me if not no harm, no foul. I ain't gonna take it personally. But anyways, y'all, I'm finna go. By the way, just got in town.